Yeah. So Nick, tell us about the, the whole process of like getting um, you know your equipment out of the warehouse and, and to the consumer. How does that work, and uh, what's the process? Yeah, so basically uh, we get all the jobs for the week, um, put it into sort of a run sheet for each day so we know what's going on each day. Mm -hmm. um, we sort of give, give the client a rough time of, of when we should be out and try and sort of set a few hours in a, a sort of a time window for them. Yeah. Uh, so the drivers uh, give them a call sort of half an hour beforehand just to let them know, look, we're, we're on the way, yeah. make sure you're there or if they're not there, they can sort of readjust their run. Um, so that's probably the most complicated process of the business is basically just trying to juggle all, uh, all the items, make sure they get delivered on time, um, picked up at the time the customer needs to get them picked up. Um, can be a bit tricky because obviously people have different time constraints and yes. access to buildings or, or function centers might be limited by certain times. So yes. it's just a, a bit of a time consuming process, but we, we try and get it right by carefully planning it and putting it into a structured run and, um, and the drivers giving the customer some notice um, so they can make changes on the day if they have to. Yeah, I imagine uh, it would be fairly hectic then, uh, you know, weekends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we weekends obviously the busiest time. Most people are having events on Saturday nights, so um, that's where we require sort of a fair few drivers and, and, and vehicles to be out on the road, um, you know, delivering it all and, and getting it all out there on time.